Because water is capable of dissolving more substances than any other liquid, it is often referred to as the universal solvent. The key to this unique capability lies within its molecular structure. Because water is a polar molecule, it is capable of dissolving other polar molecules and ionic compounds. For example, when sodium chloride, which is commonly known as table salt, comes into contact with water, a process called dissociation occurs. The chemical elements in table salt are shaped together in a crystal lattice structure, held together by ionic bonds. These elements are sodium, which is positively charged, and chloride, which is negatively charged. Because these elements have a charge, they are referred to as ions instead of atoms. When introduced to water, the water molecules are attracted to these ions. The positive part of the water molecule, the hydrogen atoms, are attracted to the chloride ions, whereas the negatively charged oxygen atom is attracted to the sodium ions. This attraction generates a force that is stronger than the ionic bonds holding the sodium and chloride ions together, so the crystal structure starts to break. The water molecules surround and separate the ions from each other, keeping them apart. As a result, the solid salt crystal dissolves in water. If enough salt is added, the water molecules will reach a point where they cannot attract or dissolve any additional salt. This is known as the saturation point.